The house took, uh, I guess, a, I, the best of my memory, about a year to build. It was slow going because I wanted to use all natural materials. Uh, there are no uh, uh, painted surfaces in the house as such. All the wood is uh, trim, ceilings, uh, cedar exposed, natural finish. Uh, the supporting structure is all uh, natural stone and the walls are, uh, the, you see in the pictures, they are not cheap rock or any uh, uh, manufactured material like that. They are stucco. Okay. And you bought this land when? I bought the land in the 1960s and well, I owned it for some time before I built the house. Long enough so that I've actually forgotten the actual year. Okay. And when did you actually um, start construction and finish? Uh, started construction in 1969, moved in in 1970. Okay. It took the better part of the year to build. It was uh, slow going. Okay. Uh, I was working in Princeton at the time, so I was out here uh, every morning before on my way to work and uh, came back for lunch and then came by again on my way home. So this was, I was living in the house informally before I moved in. Okay. And uh, tell me about your family structure. Did you build this house for yourself or for your family? Uh, well, obviously, as an architect, you build for yourself. But uh, I had a wife and two children at the time. And uh, I had a wife who had some, uh, uh, some strong ideas of her own. Okay. So I obviously paid attention to those as well. Okay. Um, and so tell me about the... Uh, um, the, the, the way the house is laid out, you have kind of a bedroom wing or living wing. The and house then... is basically divided into three parts. There's a bedroom wing, which has a master bedroom, uh, four children, small children's rooms. And uh, uh, then the, the other end of the house is, I guess you would call a living area, uh, kitchen, dining, uh, library, which uh, or family room, and, uh, and connecting the two wings is the living room or great room, you might call it, which is where we're sitting now. Which is where we're sitting now, which is about a thousand square feet, mm -hmm. roughly uh, twenty by fifty feet, and that was that was the center of the family's activities and designed to be where everybody in the family came together to participate in their own their own activities but which everybody else could share. Great.